Hey gang, this is uh, Tommy here, and uh, I want to answer a question I get a lot, and uh, that's is how to eat clean. And um, eating clean is really a matter of perspective, you know, as far as for what what is you know how do you define a clean food, dirty food, and stuff like that. But really, the way I would really sum it up is like, you know, either you're eating processed or unprocessed food. You know, the closest you can get to normal to normal or um, you know, the less times that we've that it's been able to change from its normal state, the better. All right, you always want to be within like one or two steps of uh, health of normal baseline of where it came from originally. So, how do you do that, and why would you want to do that? Well, the um, the closer it is to natural, the better your body's been able to metabolize it because your body's natural. You know, it's not your we're not a processed um, living organisms. We are a organic living dynamic uh, individual so our food should be very lively in that same sense you know whether it be the meats um, and stuff that we eat or the veggies and stuff like that but um, really if you were to go online though I mean you can get tons of this stuff um, information online and I guarantee you any of these that you see on the you know if you just went to Google right now 124 million um, results for how to eat clean they're gonna come up with three basic concepts one is awareness you know, the first thing is that once you become more aware of what's in front of you, you'll start eating better, cleaner, healthier, and uh, start looking, feeling, and living better. Okay. The second thing is adherence. You know, after you're you're kind of aware, like for starting off, you might start like looking at your food and be like, "Ugh, you know, this isn't probably the best meal," but you eat it anyways. And then later on, you'll slowly start making those changes because you're becoming more aware. Then you'll start adhering to your newfound routine that whatever fits your schedule. You know. Um, cause you don't want to do anything that doesn't work in, with your lifestyle. And the last thing is, uh, the last step that you'll see in all of these come up with is an action plan, you know, some kind of 30 day, 60 day, 90 day, you know, routine to get you back, um, on the saddle. But the problem is with any of those is that if you don't start doing something now, or you don't start becoming with square one, and that is being aware of it, you're not really going to start eating clean or looking and feeling better, um, because it just takes a little mindset. Once you change your mindset, say, hey, I'm going to start eating clean. Then the next time you go to the store, you'll probably grab like one more, you know, one, um, put back one box of something to grab one thing, you know, out of the produce section. You know, put back one more, uh, you know, item that, you know, you, one more bag of chips, let's say, and go ahead and grab like some whole potatoes and dice them up and roast them yourself. You know, I love, I love me some good roasted potatoes, especially sweet potatoes. But um, I encourage you what to do now. If you want to get a little bit more, I've actually put together a whole little shebang for you at my, uh, on my blog. Uh, go here and get my um, little free gift. I go over um, a five day course, break it up in little smart, small, small, um, sections for you about how you can start you know eating clean living healthier and a great way of course that you know my whole thing's wrapped around is these uh fun runs so go to the website um i got all the other details on there but uh just something to think about if you're uh, looking to get a little bit um leaner happier healthier all right peace